Hey guys, welcome back to Momo Gaming, and today I am finally back with another Minecraft video. And today, as you guys should know, because I'm uploading, is um, the 9/11. Uh, it is the day where the terrorist attacked in New York City, Washington, in Shanksville, Pennsylvania. Um, so I thought it would be kind of, you know, a tri to do a, a tribute to them by building the World Trade Center, uh, the Twin Towers, not the new one because um, that's out of my building skills. But anyway, so here's what we've been working on for the past two weeks. That's why I haven't brought you any Minecraft videos so far, because we've been working on this. So um, let's go ahead, and this is just going to be a short little video for a tribute to the um, last lost on that day um, by building this in Minecraft. So let's go ahead and just go ahead and get into this. Make sure you leave a like, and um, yeah, we'll move on from there. All right, so I tried to do the bottoms equivalent to the tops um, with the, you know, similar similarities but um they're, they're kind of similar i mean it's not going to be like the best builder in the world i mean it's close the doorway is kind of cool um just go in there pressure plates this is the front desk that my brother built um i'm not sure what's going on with it but this would have been the main desk when you walk into the world trade center um and if you guys don't know um Look up the World Trade Center, the Twin Towers lobby, and this is what it used to look like. There used to be flags all around, and there used to be one where you walked in. Like, this is like the ground street level, and it went down below. That's where the elevators would pick you up and go straight up. But, I made the elevators up here. So here's the stairway down. This would be es escalators, but this is what it looks like down here. Did not put that much furnishing in because I forgot. Uh, I started a about a week ago in these buildings, and... Let's just say I ran out of time. Um, so here's what the, f you know, these are the flags. Um, here's the elevators to go up. There's three, but only one is not even, the one, the one of them is not even finished. So let's go ahead up to the second floor. And this is what the second floor is. It's just a bunch of redstone that, that um, you know, shows you all the lights down below. Um, kind of be cool because all these light switches over here, because this is my brother's redstone working. So that one controls the X in the in the middle. This one controls the circle in be in the middle, and this controls all the outer lights over there. So it's kind of cool. We always keep them on though. All right. So now there's not going to be much up here, guys. I'm just going to show you what the general floor plan looks like. Um, we'll stop at this one because it's open. If I can get there. Um, so this is what one of the floors would have looked like in Minecraft version. Um, we put glowstone in. I'll show you what a view of it looks like at night. So it kind of looks fun. But this is what it would look like. Um, and one of the floors in the World Trade Center. Um, I should have furnished one for you guys, but like I said, ran out of time. And let me just tell you, these floors are 40 by 40, or maybe 50 by 50. I forget what I did. But let me just say, they are not fun to do constantly. So I th I'm not sure what's going on up here, but here's all the floors. I'm just going to go straight up for you guys. Only lit a few of them up. Okay, here's what one of the sky lobbies would have looked like. This would be where the iron is. Um, in the outer building, what, here I'll look through the window. That's what that looks like on the outside. Um, if you look up a real picture of the World Trade Center, that's what they would look like. I'll probably uh, add another World Trade Center picture in at the end for you guys. Um, so here's what each floor, you know, a bunch. Obviously, there was 110 in the original. I think there's like 40 here, and this is what it looks like left because I didn't have the time to finish. So about this is the um, I believe this would be the North Tower in my perspective. Um, the no top of the North Tower in the South Tower, I believe, were restaurants. I know one of them at least had, it was called Windows in the World and other ones. Uh, my brother started on it, ultimately did not finish it. This is what the top one, this would be floor 110, 108, 108 to 110 in real life. So let's just go ahead and drop all the way back down. Yeah, lots of floors. Okay, so here we go. And then here's where the elevator picks up. So here's what the lobby looks like. Um, you know, best of we could, there's some decorations, like I said, wish I had a little bit more time to do it. So, uh, here, let me show you ahead, guys, what, there's the sky lobbies, the white, the, uh, which will be iron blocks in this, um, time will be, that, that is your sky lobbies, there's two of them per building. Um, and then here's the south tower, this one is not nearly, this is the south tower, I'm sorry, that was the north tower. This is the south tower, not nearly furnished like the other one so you'll see what I mean by that in a minute see there's no redstone um, there's like no plants or anything just a bunch of glowstone floating around no escalators no elevators um, this is pretty much the lobby to this one um, I will do a video to you for you guys maybe in October 
and the, all of these buildings will be completely furnished. The lobbies will be done. Uh, if I ever make this a open server for anybody to join, um, you could have office spaces to yourselves, furnish them. Um, I'll leave a comment if you would like to join that open server um, in the future and if you want me to start it. Um, I play on Xbox One for your information. Um, so as you guys can see, I didn't even, I did one floor in that building. This one has about 30 floors done. Um, so it's getting there. Um, eventually I will do on the bottom of the building uh, parking garages like there was. There were six floors below. There was a shopping mall, train, center, uh, train station or subway station on the below. So let's go ahead and turn it tonight. And sorry guys, I'm a little rushed. But, okay, let's go ahead and turn it to night and see what they look like. I'm not too sure what they look like at night, so. This is what they look like at night. That's not bad, actually, for what they are. Um, so let's go ahead and fly around here. Yeah, it's not bad. I mean, they kind of look kind of cool. Um, see how this one has, like, more lights, like, on a floor-wide stand? Yeah, that's because this one doesn't have any floors. And this one has a lot nicer lights. But, yeah, I mean, it looks a lot more lit up than the rest of the stinking city. So this is what they look like at night. Um, doesn't look too bad. There. Anyway, so here's what the outer. We did the outer stuff for the iron, and I think there might be something on top for us. So you guys all know that the original. Twi I'll turn it back to day now. Anyway, you all know that the North Tower of the World Trade Center, which will be Building 1, if you ever looked into it that closely, had the little spiral on top. So, knowing me, I built the towers to world limit, and yeah, they're kind of fat compared to what they should be, because guess what? There's world height. So, this is your world height. Well, I forgot to um, add the point in. Like, when I built it, I was, I was already done with Building 1, and I was like, oh yeah, there's a point. Well... This is what my brother decided to do is the point. Yeah, it doesn't go much higher than that. That's as high as the world will go. Uh, that made me a little mad because I was like, oh, you know, that kind of ruins what they look like. So that one just had the antenna on for the North Tower. If you ever looked at the top, they just have the North Tower with the antenna, no observation decks or anything. And the South Tower, on the other hand, there was no antenna or point or whatever the heck you want to call it. It just had... Um, it, I think it might have. This one had a helipad, I believe, in too. But my brother added a helipad on here, and this was an observation deck. So, like, you could come up in tourist, and then you could look down over the rest of the city, which should be. It's the rest of the city's over here. So you look be looking down, and even if you look hard enough, uh, apparently off the building. So my uncle visited the World Trade Center, um, in the 2000 or 1999 when they were still standing before they collapsed. And he said he could ultimately see people and working in their offices on the observation deck. So that's how close the towers were. Um, but as you know, they're no longer standing due to some terrorists. Anyway, here's the helipad. Um, he, I'm sure he's got some redstone down under that or something. I don't know how that works. But yeah, so guys, that will be my Twin Tower tour. Um, trip. This is a tribute, guys. I will, you know... This is not to make fun of anything like that. This is just pure for, you know, a tribute to the people who lost their lives in the towers and at the Pentagon as well as in Shanksville, Pennsylvania. Um, I was going to do, um, like, the fountains next to it and the One World Trade Center building. That will be coming up in October, November, or December when I get around to building them because um, school has started and it's taking a very long time to do the, all the work for it. So, guys... Um, this is my 9-11 tribute to the victims lost in the Twin Towers that day. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed. Leave a like to see some more, to see if I can finish these buildings, f completely furnish them and everything like that. So guys, I hope you enjoyed. Please like and subscribe to see, see, to see future videos. And as always, thank you for watching.